A cable series that's filmed in and around Charlotte is pulling the plug on North Carolina. The Showtime series Banshee is packing up and moving to New Orleans. We're told the show's producers made that decision after lawmakers in Raleigh failed to renew tax breaks for TV and movie productions. Sources tell NBC Charlotte at least four other shows that were considering Charlotte have decided to look somewhere else for the same reason. A praise and criticism from North Carolina Governor Pat McCrory as he weighs in on the General Assembly's short session. And during a taping for NBC Charlotte's Flashpoint, he talks about the sometimes bitter turf battle in Raleigh. 20 months into his job as North Carolina's chief executive, Governor Pat McCrory is finding his stride and sometimes finding frustration. 80% of what my legislature, our legislature did, including the Senate, they didn't any work. Some stuff they shouldn't be doing midnight sessions. And in some cases, he's threatening to use his veto pen. Two-thirds of the coal ash bill is very good. One-third is very poorly written. McCrory's well-publicized disagreements with Republican Senate leaders prompted the governor during a recent radio interview to use biting words, comparing them to a vilified Democrat. And that's the stuff Harry Reid does in, in D.C. right now. McCrory maintains his disagreements with the Senate president are territorial, not personal. What is your relationship like with Phil Berger? Is it strained? No, actually, we get along. We just have a, you know, the Senate is an, inst there's been a culture of um, institutional turf between the Senate, the House, and the executive branch. The oil billionaire Koch brothers are showering millions on Tom Tillis like he's one of the family. In the campaign for U.S. Senate, Democrats maintain that conservatives Charles and David Koch are helping to set the agenda for House Speaker Tom Tillis and North Carolina's General Assembly. McCrory shrugs off that suggestion. Do these. they influence legislation in North Carolina, the Koch brothers? I wouldn't know of it. Yeah. I mean, I've never had conversations about any legislation with uh, anyone associated with the Koch brothers. You haven't smiled the whole damn time, man. I'm a little worried. And if you question McCrory's commitment to bipartisanship, check out his hug with Vice President Joe Biden during the National Governors Conference. I didn't know what to do when he started walking my way. I was in shock. The other governors afterwards said, you were Biden. <laughs> he has since wrote me a note. He wrote me a very nice uh, note saying thanks for being a good sport. He, he's a very nice guy. You can see the entire interview with Governor McCrory this Sunday morning at 11 on Flashpoint.